Hello there, my name is Tom Crandall from Gear Mashers, and today I got a really cool product in. It's by Alico. They make great stuff. Anyway, it's called the Oppen Collar, and we're going to take a look at it. All right, so we're back. So the Oppen Collar retails for $75, uh, so it puts it on the high end of the the under $100 collars. Uh, for instance, uh, this is by Rogue. This is their uh, USA aluminum collar. And then I have uh, the Osso collar, and this is magnetic. And then I also have another one by Rogue, the HG uh, collar. So they're all really good collars, but what makes the Alico one rather unique is its open face design. It has uh, rubber on the inside and on the outside. It also contains magnets, so you can stick it on anything metal, and it will stick, um, which is really nice. The other nice feature is, since it is magnetic, the magnets are underneath the rubber, um, so they're not gonna scratch anything. Same thing on any posts or anything like that, which is nice, um, because like with this Rogue Oso collar, uh, when I put it on here, it can scratch uh, because it's metal on metal. Same thing on the posts. It got that nice big clank, um, but it, it's another good collar. So why would you want this one, say, over the Rogue collars? Well, the open face design means that um, rather than, say, for instance, on this Rogue one, having to slide it up and down the sleeve here, um, I can just simply put it right next to my weight and then lock it in place. Um, and since it has magnets, as long as you have like a competition plate or something like that that has metal here, um, it actually helps get the, uh, the collar closer to the weight itself. And then to open it, it's, uh, you just take it off. Um, so that, I think, is sort of a, a beneficial aspect of this. It just makes uh, taking off plates and then putting collar black back on a little bit easier. Uh, because like with these normal ones, you know, you, you say, I don't know, for bench, I usually start out at 135 pounds. And so I have my collar on there and then I have to take my collar off, add the weight, put the collar back on. Um, but with this one, it just makes it a little bit easier. And then I just take it off and boom, I can add some weight and then put it back on. So it's, it's really quick uh, to add on. Um, the other thing is it's, it's a little bit heavier than a lot of the other um, road collars that I have at least it comes in at 250 grams uh, so like this uh, USA aluminum collar um, this weighs about 130 grams so I'm putting it on here it's about 132 is what it got this uh, HG collar weighs in at uh, 206 and this uh, the one with the magnets the Oso weighs in at uh, 206 as well so it's a little bit heavier uh, but the price point is a little bit more expensive um, I did do a jump test. I don't know if you want to see it or not, but anyway, uh, I put some weights on and jumped on it with the collar on here, and I found that the collar didn't hold up as well as the USA Aluminum. And, and as a matter of fact, when uh, Coop did his experiment, I believe the Rogue USA Aluminum was the one that won out. Um, comparing it against the Alico, uh, it won again. Um, so if... You know, I don't know how many people are actually going to be jumping on their weights, but uh, it's something to consider. If you want something that's going to hold your weights and you don't have to worry about them moving, uh, this is a really good deal, $50 for a collar. Um, the other thing that's really nice is this uh, quick release lever, um, sort of like a, a bike lever, I guess. I don't know. I, I like it. But with the Lico collar, Obviously, it is a little quicker to load your weights and, and have a collar on there. Um, and it, it can be one hand as far as putting it on. So you could grab some weights with one hand, slide them down, the other hand, put the collar on, and it's locked in place. So I do find that sort of nice. Um, but with this, since it is open face, you don't have, uh, like with the, the Rogue one, um, most of the rubber here actually contacts the bar. So obviously you don't have any contact on the open side. Um, and where th this would fail is this mechanism 
right here. I don't know if you can see it, but that's where it's gonna fail if it's gonna fail at all. Um, because what I found is when I was jumping on the weights, this rubber um, was actually sliding a little bit. You can sort of see that. I can even pull it with my hand. And so that allowed the collar to slide down the sleeve a little bit. But for most people, um, especially if you're not gonna be putting in a ton of weight, this collar is gonna be great. Um, and it is easy to use, so, and it's by Alico. They have a year warranty, I guess, on it. So, um, and by the way, I, I did purchase this, just FYI, because um, I wanted to check it out. So anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Definitely hit that like button and uh, leave a comment if you have any questions or anything like that, I'll try to answer them. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.